hello everyone welcome back to my channel i am here to do some more missing people cases um you want to know what article i'm reading this off of is ourblackgirls.com i'm here to break the codes if i see any i'm here to see where their bodies are located if they know and i'm also here to see they are alive deceased or body suits is being made of them so let's begin this is about lillian l-i-l-l-i-a-n williams 41 went missing in 1967 or 1968. This is what she looked like, and she did say Mile Jam did it, aka the Atlanta boy killer. Okay, because his last name is Williams. It is unfortunate when little information has been shared about a case, but it is downright upsetting when there aren't even descriptive stats about a missing person. Once again, a case from Louisiana captured my attention. She said she got burned at the state. Capture my attention because there was so little information given about Lillian Williams. The 41-year-old disappeared from, Gra from Grambling, Louisiana, back in the 1960s. However, it is unclear what year sh she last made contact with friends, colleagues, or loved ones. It's also what she looks like. I'm hearing family, so she could have been my family. Okay, she do look familiar. According to databases, Lillian Williams was last seen at her home at Grambling State University in Lincoln Parish. It was reported that it was in either 1967 or 1968, and sadly, that is all we know about the missing woman. She had never been seen or heard from since that time. She said devoured. Any information about her personal or professional life has not been shared publicly. I could not find any news reports about the mysterious case. And it's unclear if she was living on or off campus. She's saying she was my grandma's sister. There also wasn't any information available about, available about Lillian's. So there could be a body suit of her family, whether she was married or had children. She said neither, or the such efforts related to this case. At the time of her disappearance, Lillian Williams stood anywhere between 5 feet to 5 feet 10 inches tall and weighed 90 to 200 pounds. These stats mean that her height and weight was unknown. She had black, dark brown hair and brown eyes. No other descriptors was given. Her middle name is Culbert, C-U-L-B-E-R-T. Lillian's dental records and fingerprints are reportedly not on file, but her DNA profile is available. So there is some family of hers left, but her fingerprints and dental records will be moved. She will be well into her 90s if still alive. She says she is not. She died around them two years. Anyone with information about this case is urged to contact the Lincoln Parish Sheriff's Office at 318-251-5111 or their local authorities. The agency case number is 14080153. Please share this story about Lillian Williams to help reunite interest into her missing person case. She is our sister and her life matters. So if y'all want to help with this case, y'all can. I don't do it for the fame or the money. I do because it's what I love to do. I'm out. Peace.